your studies can make you feel so unhealthy. Hello, welcome back. Sorry it's been so long since I posted. This past year was crazy. Many things happened, many things changed. And even though I wanted to be present here, I just couldn't. I got a job and I worked there for a year. I moved into a new house and it's been my last year of uni, which of course, just by that, it's a stressful period and I had a lot of work to do and it's been tough. I kind of wanted this video to be true and honest about my experience finishing uni in these last months. So if this video can be a little pat on your shoulder, uh, to anyone watching, I'd be glad. Just know that you're not alone. After the struggle, success will come. Good morning. This past week I've been trying to find ways on how to stay productive and not cause myself burnout and headaches. I've been trying to reduce my screen time, especially on the mornings, and to make it easier I've deleted TikTok, which I'm proud of. Like if I'm working I'm already looking at a screen all day, but then I get home or like have some free time and I spend it looking at my phone. I don't want that because I will feel sick uh, by the end of this month. And I've finished this book before the coffee gets cold. I actually bought it when I was in Florence and the lady that gave it to me gave me a present and it's in Italian, but it's from the same author and it's just like a journal to write your moments of serenity. And I think that's really cute. So we'll continue being book enjoyers for sure. I've been really into design and minimalism lately and these two books have been key to learn a lot about it. One is actually a photography book that talks about the importance of nature in Korean design. It might seem really technical but I'm actually learning a lot about my style and the importance of finding beauty in simple things. Apparently this is a kid's park. It is what it is. What can I say? It's two. <laughs> so today I quit my job. Opted for a new path and hopefully new and better opportunities. And I'm feeling hopeful about it. People often say that stress comes to you in a physical form once you stop doing whatever you were doing. And I experienced that in the past week. That's why I decided to take a break and give more importance to my friends and my social life, which I was lacking. And it made such a positive impact on my well-being and my mental health. I'm waiting for my professors to come. I'm not feeling nervous anymore. I think we got it. 
it's officially over uh, I think it went really well it feels crazy because I've been working on this for like eight months and it's just done like that this is your sign to be confident if you're thinking of doing something creative do it and if I can do it honestly you can do it too